Visibility one five, two clouds at two four thousand. Temperature five, two point minus niner. Altimeter three zero three four. Toronto, Toronto at zero 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 zero. So this is a single sideband on uh, the original LC90, single sideband was not there. With firmware upgrades, they've added single sideband. But this is kind of cool because with firmware upgrades, you can change things around, make things better. And that gives a lot of power to this radio. Now, with the latest firmware, it's also the only radio that updates its firmware via Wi-Fi. So with the latest firmware, no more going, getting files and trying all sorts of cryptic things with your computers. It will update itself through um, the Wi-Fi connection. So what I have here, if we go down, because Wi-Fi is off because I don't want to have crackle on the audio, the version info, you press. It's all a question of pressing the buttons. So this is the latest firmware that I have. And so uh, this seems to be dated 12th of April. So it's a very recent firmware here. So it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. Let's then go back to shortwave. So here it reverts back to AM mode. What I have to do if I want to go to sideband, I just simply press shortwave again. Cycles through upper sideband or lower sideband as we go through it. And here we go. It's frequency accuracy is pretty good from the from the start. Uh, just now there's pretty much very little adjustment to do to have perfect voice. It's kind of cool. The only problem, it's a problem that a, a lot of other manufacturers have done, is the sideband is kind of tuning in reverse. It's kind of weird. But they're sideband, and this is kind of cool to have this on this radio too. So Trenton Military 6754 kilohertz. The AGC is a little harsh, but I would note that it's less harsh than I've, what I've seen on the Texan radios. Like the 990 or the H501 is, is rougher than this one. Yet, it still is not equal to what is in the SANG and ATS 909, which is smoother. Let's try uh, Gander Radio 6604. Let's try 10051. There you go. So this is Gander Radio. The only thing you don't want is a birdie on the frequency you're trying to tune. That's what makes it tough. Next, let's try 13.270. So you see on 13.270, it's there beneath a tone, and that tone is a birdie from the radio itself. So that is the major problem for this radio. Remove the birdies, and I'm gonna say, this little radio is impressive for all that it can do. And, um, it would be just removing the birdies would change my mind into giving it a very high grade. Broadcast of zero 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 zero